Hi everyone, News A Meteorologist Leanne Beyer here, and today we are here to talk about the drought monitor. We're actually going to talk about the positives of it rather than the negatives, because sometimes it's good to have a little bit of positivity in your life. But let's start out with the basics. The U.S. Drought Monitor releases a new map every Thursday to talk about the level of severity of drought all across parts of the United States. But for this video and for this article, we're going to talk about Western New York specifically, and actually even more specifically, our viewing area for WROC. So, over the last few months, parts of Western New York and actually parts of different counties such as Monroe, Livingston, Orleans, Genesee, and Wyoming counties have actually been placed under a moderate drought. And we actually go ahead now and draw where this drought was found. And we were put, placed under a moderate drought, which if you look at the left side of your computer screen was kind of like a tannish color. So you're looking at this map and you say, okay, all I see is a yellow color. Well, this is actually the positivity that I want to give you guys. We are no longer under a moderate drought. The U.S. Drought Monitor actually took away that moderate drought here. So this is good news. We're still abnormally dry in many parts of our viewing area. It looks like Yates County is the only county that is not under an abnormally dry situation. But this is good news. I mean, we've been under that moderate drought for probably, I want to say, since the beginning of the year. And even at the beginning of the year, we started out with a severe drought, but that was quickly downgraded to a moderate drought. So we are making progress. That rain, actually, that we've been experiencing over the last several days has been helping our drought. So we got to keep our fingers crossed and hope that the U.S. Drought Monitor continues to improve and that we can see maybe normal conditions here in western New York rather than abnormally dry.